Hello everyone, welcome back to Tech Genie. In this video, I will be sharing the best way to fix Windows security not opening on Windows 10 and Windows 11. Now before proceeding, I would really appreciate that if you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you get the solution after watching this video. The very first solution that I would recommend you that you should try resetting the Windows security. So what you have to do on your Windows 10 or 11 search box, you have to click on it, type Windows security you will be getting windows security in the suggestion right click on it and choose app settings here scroll down a bit and you will find the option of reset click on reset click reset again and once it's been done again check back if the problem has been fixed and if yes then you are good to go and if not then move with the next solution now right click on the windows icon click on settings here in the setting you have to search for troubleshoot then click on troubleshoot settings here click on additional troubleshooter and now scroll down and you will find windows store apps click on it and then click on run the troubleshooter now this will try to detect some kind of problem and if there is any it will either let you know or it can also fix the problem so wait until the process has been completed and it says you can reset that app aren't working right from app and feature open app and feature select the app that not working tap or click advanced option then reset so we have already done that option so we won't do that now we can close it now on windows 10 uh, you just make sure that you have enabled the background application and the windows security so right click on the windows icon again choose settings here click on privacy now scroll down and you will find an option of background apps so click on it and now scroll down and make sure that this background app option has been enabled at least for windows security all right so either you can just turn it on and after that you can close it and now you can restart the computer and see that if the problem has been fixed and if not then next what you have to do you have to click on the search box type here powershell you will be getting windows powershell right click on it and choose run as administrator then click on yes the blue window will be coming up now here you have to run few command that you will be getting in the description so copy the first command make a right click here now and it will be automatically pasted once done hit enter again and now here you have to press the a key from your keyboard and hit enter again again copy the next command from the description right click over here it will be automatically pasted again hit enter and then finally copy the third command from the description paste here hit enter again it may take some time so wait until the process has been completed and now we also need to run few command from the command prompt so click on the search box type cmd the command prompt will be up right click on it and choose run as administrator then click on yes to give the permission and the black window will be coming up now here the first command that you have to type will be dism space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash scan health all these commands you will find in the description you can copy and paste here once done now it will be scanning so it may take some time so wait until this is 100% completed once done again you have to copy the next command and paste here and hit enter again again wait for the command to be completed and then finally we will be running a last command all right so now we can finally run the last command that is sfc space forward slash scan now hit enter again and now this will again take some time because this will be scanning for all kind of system integrity violation any kind of corrupted file so wait until the command has been completed <laughs> Alright, so this is also 100% completed now it says windows resource protection did not find any integrity violation but you may see some different message that says there was some integrity violation as and it has been automatically fixed so once you are done you have to close it now try to restart your pc and try to check if the problem has been fixed and if not the next what you can do you can try updating your windows operating system so click on the search box type update you will be getting check for update the update option will be up now here you can click on check for update option and if there are any update kindly let it go and update your windows operating system 
once updated check back again if the problem is being fixed and if not next what you can do you can try to restore the computer where your computer was working fine so for that click on the search box type rstrui.exe hit enter the system restore will be coming up now here you have to click on next and you will be getting some kind of date here so you have to choose the date and then you can just click on next and then it will take some time and your computer will be restored to the date when your computer was working fine now in case nothing work for you then finally you will have to try resetting your pc so click on the search box type here reset you will be getting the option of reset this pc so this is the final option guys if nothing works for you and you need windows security anyhow then you have to go with this option here you have to click on get started then you will be getting an option of keep my file so this will only remove app and setting but keep your personal file so your data will be remaining rest all other application and setting will be resetted so once you are okay you can click on this option follow the steps and after that once it will be completely resetted you will find that your windows security option is back so that's all guys hopefully this complete list of solution will surely help you to fix this windows security option not opening not working on windows 10 and windows 11 and if you found this helpful do not forget to like and subscribe for any issues let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye